Well, good morning. It's Crazy Cheap Chick. And today I have some ideas on what you can do with little specialty pumpkins. Now, back in November, right after Halloween, my grocery store had a whole bunch of these little specialty pumpkins for about a quarter each. And I bought four of them thinking I would save the seeds out of them. And so that's number one thing I'm going to do with these. Um, but there are several other things that I came up with that I could use these for too. And now I wish I would have bought like 10 or 15 of them for a quarter because uh, what I've been using them for turned out so cute. So hold on to your hats. I'm going to show you some stuff you can do with little tiny pumpkins. This fall, I had bought several of these little specialty pumpkins. It was like after Halloween and they were only a quarter. Well, the reason I bought them is I wanted to save the seeds out of them and try to grow some of these myself. And today is January 14th and I'm just getting around to saving the seeds. So first we're gonna cut out the top. I took the top out and now I'm gonna take all these seeds and put them on a plate to dry. Now, I don't know if they'll grow. If this is some kind of weird hybrid, it may not produce a pumpkin. Boy, that was almost more seed than pumpkin. Now, I think I might widen this out a little bit for what I'm gonna use it for. And I'm also gonna save this little stem because I make these really cute little craft pumpkins. So then you just spread out the seeds to dry. And in the spring, you can plant these. And I've marked on here what they are because I know in a week I won't remember. So there they are. These will dry. And here's the little pumpkin. Okay, so I hollowed it out a little bit. And one thing that's cute to do with this, and I was gonna do it tonight because I'm having some friends over for some snacks and wine, is I was gonna put dip in here. And so you can put your dip for chips or raw vegetables, and it's just a cute little container um, that you just throw away at the end of the evening. But I decided to try something different with this. I went to a dollar store today to look for something else and I saw this plant hanger and of course the dollar store is now a dollar twenty-five store but it's just a little chain plant hanger and I'm gonna put it in put this pumpkin in this little chain plant hanger I'm gonna put bird seed in here and see how that works this is kind of weird because it just goes down to three hooks like to hook onto a pot but I still think I can hook them together and make it work I've got these toothpicks and I think I might stick some toothpicks in there for the birds to land on. I stuck some toothpicks in there to be kind of perches for the birds. And I'm also sticking some through the bottom to kind of hold those chains in place. Instead of bird seed, I think I might put um, some suet seed in there. I hollowed out that pumpkin. I stuck in four toothpicks to um, be perches. I've got three toothpicks on the bottom to hold the chain, and now I'm going to attach the chain. And I put suet in the center, so, and they will eat this pumpkin too, I'm sure. May not last very long, I don't know. See how I've hooked the chain around the toothpicks on the bottom? Those will kind of help stabilize it, I think. There is the finished product, and I think it's kind of cute. And now I just need to go find a place to hang it up outside. My husband loves birds, so I think this is going to be kind of cute. I normally have ferns <clears throat> that I hang up out here in the summer. And so this gives him a little bird feeder in front of his office. Hopefully it'll work. I've hollowed out this pumpkin and I've saved the seeds out of it because that was when I bought these, that was why I bought them was to save the seeds. But now I think I'm gonna put some dirt in here and plant something in here. This is probably a long shot, but I did take um, some dirt and put inside this little pumpkin and I put a few seeds in there. And um, I, the reason I don't think it'll work is the pumpkin will probably rot, but if it did work, these would be really great for when you're growing your starts because let's say you planted your tomato in there. Well, then after the tomato grew, you could just plant this directly in the ground and it would almost be like a fertilizer, wouldn't it? As this rotted, I don't know. Anyway, that was another idea I had that I'm just experimenting with. 
So we came up with about four different ways to use these mini pumpkins that I only paid a quarter each for. One, save the seeds and grow them next year. Make a bird feeder out of it. Um, use it as a dip holder and possibly use it as a um, compostable planter. Um, if that works, I'm probably gonna try planting some uh, tomatoes in the future in these and then I can plant them straight in the ground. And there's probably a million things you could do with these. Now I've tried eating them and they're usually not that great <laughs> to eat. So tell me what you use them for. I'm always curious the ideas that other people come up with. And once again, thank you so much for watching my video all the way to the end. I really appreciate it. And uh, I hope you have a great evening.